time for one last quick story that will put a smile on your face, hopefully. This is what I'm liking. So mamas, all of us at one point have felt like the worst parent on earth. And if you haven't, that's probably because you are. <laughs> Whether it's forgetting to pack a diaper bag, serving your kid chicken nuggets five days in a row, you've done it, or letting your kid play Roblox for, I don't know, four hours straight, because you just needed a minute. We've all been there. I haven't, I'm perfect, but you've been there maybe. Um, so in solidarity, let's spare some sympathy for a Minnesota mama who realized, this is amazing, after years, years, that she was celebrating her son's birthday on the wrong date. <laughs> Take a look. <laughs> I just got off the phone with my pediatrician. She's trying to bill our last visit to our insurance company. Per my words, my son's birthday is the 26th. I'm his mother. I know his birthday. The insurance company says no. His birthday's on the 25th. For two years, I've been celebrating his birthday on the 26th. You want to know the worst part? The worst part. It's my middle child. <laughs> oh my God. The best part of that is my sister is going to love that part. She's a middle child, the bereft child. Everything didn't happen for her. Um, we have that mom, Emily, on the line right now. Oh my gosh, Emily, I love you. This oh is so God. funny. I've just never heard of it. So wait, your insurance company is actually how you found out that you were celebrating your son's birthday on the wrong day. Yes. So my pediatrician's <laughs> office calls me because she can't bill the visit. The birthday that I gave her is wrong than what the insurance company is saying. And mm -hmm. I was about to call the insurance company and give them a piece of my mind because I know his birthday. I'm his mother. <laughs> but before I called them, you know, I thought maybe I should scroll back Facebook just to make sure and sure enough. The insurance company had it right. Of course they did. <laughs> and it made stick in national news my mom fail heard around the world. Gosh. <laughs> Wait, that's the best part, too. You didn't, like, fail alone, though. Your husband didn't know either. Ugh. If this, if this was my husband's mistake, it wouldn't be national news. Is I called him the other night, do you know any of our kids' birthdays? And we have four kids, and he got the birth months right, but zero of the dates. So <laughs> You're like, so you know what? Crawl under this bus with me, sir. <laughs> it's like, oh my God, I love it. This is one of my favorite mom fails I've ever heard of. I love you so much. Um, congratulations. It's his birthday today as well. I'm claiming it. This is, this is Henry's birthday as well. I'm liking your post right now, okay? <laughs> it's just never not going to be funny. Oh, my God. Okay, so that's not all. Our season-long partner, Pilot Pin, makers of G2, the go-to pin of the Kelly Clarkson Show, want to honor mamas just like you because you're working hard out. you got a lot of kids, girl. Congratulations. They're going to write you a check for $1,000. Yeah, see? Your mom fails.